Good day everyone. I am Abdul Halid Bayo Rascal and I'm going to talk about graph coloring. Introduction. Graph coloring started in the mid 1800s. Francis Guthrie tried to color the map of England so that it would be easy to distinguish the countries the countries sharing a common border countries with the same border must have different color in graph coloring each vertex of a graph will be assigned one color no two adjacent vertices have the same color uh, and <clears throat> A practical application of the graph coloring problem is in scheduling meetings or events. Si Francis Guthrie ay uh, isang tanyag na matematisyan. Sinubukan niya, sinubukan niya daw i-colorize ang buong kontinente ng England. At sa kabila ng ganyang several attempts ay nag-success siya. At dito nagsimula ang theory niya na kung tawagin ay four color of theory. Planner graph. A planner graph is a graph that can be drawn so that no edges intersect each other except at vertices. Magkikita naman natin sa letter A, figure A, ito yung planner, pati yung figure letter B is non-planner. sa planner graph is ito yung magkukonek yung mga vertices sa uh, edges uh, without intersection sa loob ng graph uh, and then ang non-planner graph naman ito yung graph na bawat vertex is magkukonek sa pamamagitan ng intersection sa madaling salita magkakabanggaan yung mga line vertex at magpo-form ito ng cross line sa loob <coughs> And then, chromatic numbers. The minimum number of colors needed to color a graph so that no edge connects vertices of the same color. Which means, kinakalangan na konti lang ang gagamitin na kulay upang walang gilid na nag-ugnay sa vertices ng magkaparehong kulay. Two color theorem. Uh, two colorable graph theory. A graph is two colorable. It and only if it has no circuits that consists of an odd number of vertices. Which means dalawang kulay lang ang ilalagay sa isang graph kung wala ding mga circuit or sa or paligid na binubuo ng odd numbers about vertices four, four color theorem the chromatic number of a planar graph is at most four uh, four color theorem naman kinagkalangan yung chromatic numbers is hindi susubra sa apat most of four for example ilan ba yung chromatic number dito apat Kasi yung chromatic number, yung mga kulay na iba-iba, yung mga vertices, iba-iba kulay pero hindi magkukonek. Ba sa, yung sa figure 1, kahit madami siyang edges, konti lang yung chromatic number niya, apat lang na kulay. Tapos sa figure 2 naman, medyo konti yung edges or yung chromatic number niya. Hindi natin maaari ilagay yung blue kasi mag-connect din siya sa blue. Bale, maging tatlo na yung ugnayan ng blue. At hindi rin maaaring ilagay yung green sa gitna. Gaya ng sinabi ko kanina, hindi pwedeng i-connect yung, mga, yung magka parehong kulay kasi hindi na siya matatawag na chromatic number. And then, example number 2. Six students' clubs need to hold meetings on the same day, but some students belong to more than one club in order to avoid members missing, missing meetings. 
the meetings need to be scheduled during different time slots and x in the table below indicates that the two corresponding clubs share at least one member use graph coloring to determine the minimum number of time slots necessary to ensure that all club members can attend all meetings tinutukin yun ito is anim na club ang kinakailangan mag attend sa meeting sa parehong araw at para maiwasan ang mga estudyante ay o ang mga miyembro magliban sa meeting kinakailangan may schedule sa iba't ibang time slot yung x sa table may kita natin x sa table is nangangulugang dalawang katumbas na club ito na yung table na tinutukoy ko then bali bago mo magagawa magago, eh, bago mo magawa itong table is unahin muna natin gawin ito sa right side itong figure dito itong graph ito talagang first na gawin bago bago mo, bago mo siya magawa itong table then <clears throat> Yung sa SN is student newspaper and HS is honor society, BA, biology association, GE. GE naman is ito yung, ito yung gaming club, DT, debate team, and EC engineering club. So, yung sa SN naman is dalawa yung nakakonek sa kanya, diba? Dalawa yung kwan nyo nagkonek siya sa BA pati DT makikita naman natin nailagay naman yung X sa BA saan hanapin nyo yung BA yung Biology Association ayun X means dalawang club no tapos yung sa DT naman di ba nagkonek din siya sa S and Wali yung student newspaper, hanap natin yung debate team. Ayun, may X din. Kinakailangan talaga natin matukoy itong table para malaman natin yung tinutukoy na time slots para sa meeting. Bali, yung sa student newspaper is dalawa, dalawang X lang. So, no society, uh, tatlo. So, yung kikita naman natin, tatlo yung nakakonek sa HS. EC, pati DT, pati BA sa Biology Association naman is tatlo din uh, tatlo din GE, SN, pati HS sa Gaming Club, tatlo din BA DT, EC so sa debate team is tatlo din GE, pati SN yung nakakonek sa kanya wala yung engineering club is dalawa din ito na yan. Take minimum numbers of colors and assign them to the vertices of the given figure. Ito na yung kukulayan natin. Sino? No? Kukulayan natin bawat take minimum numbers of colors. <coughs> take minimum. Ang lagay natin dito is dalaw minimum of 2. 2 color. Green pati yellow. Green pati yellow lang nagamit natin kasi konti lang talaga yung mga hindi natin maaaring gamit uh, ng tatlo so hindi sila makakonek-konek bali reuse the colors to draw the graph ito na yun siya yung green, tatlong green tatlong yellow yung green nakakonek sa yellow nakakonek sa yellow mapapansin nyo naman walang green na nakakonek din sa green di ba? si hindi matatawag na chromatic number kung magkukonek yung magkaparehong kulay color the minimum numbers of color use has been obtained as 2 na 2 lang yung nagamit natin dito na kulay and the color represent the time slot ah ito na yung sinasabi yung time slot o puwang na oras kinakailangan natin time slot para sa meeting Dalawa lang ang nagamit natin na color. It means yun ang time slot natin is 2. And dito lang matatapos itong report ko. Thank you.